Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Zillia. So, back up on the other right side of the map that we were on last time. The chest was down there when we went backwards a little bit. Uh, but this time, we're going to go ahead on up here. And the texture is a little flat. Or rather, the polygons are a little flat. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, in between episodes, uh, Mila leveled up because I fought some stuff. Um, so she leveled up a little. That's good. Okay. Oh, damn. Okay. Well, fine. Fight you then. Oh, sweet. Jude's about to level up too, which is always good. Leveling up is my favorite thing to do in these games. Okay, so it looks like we gotta go... Up this way. Yep. Um, looks like there's something up there, maybe. Vaguely? No. It looks like that's a platform for some reason, and I don't know why? Looks like there's there there's definitely more above us, but we're going this way for now. And the right stick is still twisting and doing weird things. Uh, oh, it looks like there's a chest over here. I don't need any Pantsia bottles, but okay, thank you. Oh, and it looks like we can jump down if we want to get down quickly, which is good. Ooh, real big fish just came on. Guess I'll have to wait until then. Yeah, and it probably sounds like I'm stuck in the 90s a little bit with loving third wave ska as much as I do. But I just, I just love it. There's something about the music. It's just so good. Ah, uh, it's the horns, the, the, the vocals, the singing itself. Um, I just, everything kind of comes together in a way that I really, really like. And um, a lot of newer music nowadays doesn't do that for me. <laughs> Even though I'm still finding new music um, that came out 15 years ago and it's amazing. Also, new ska is kind of coming out, but not like it used to. Um, but I love it. I should share, I think I've shared my, the link to my station on Pandora before, um, but not like publicly, like personally. Um, I should probably share it publicly at some point uh, for those of you that care. Though, the only problem is, is that it wanted to play a lot of reggae third wave ska because that's where third wave ska gets its influence is originally from like a reggae from reggae roots. But I don't particularly care for reggae. And so I had to like downvote a lot of it um, so that I could just get just third wave ska like Real Big Fish, Streetlight Manifesto, um, and other and other bands like similar to them. Um, Catch 22. God, so many. Um, but then it also kind of turned into giving me a little bit of alternative a little bit of pop like I'll get um, fallout boys every so often which is strange but then I'll also get like third eye blind from like when I was younger and, and stuff like that I'll get Jason Mraz and all that I, I just get really it's it's a radio station that has finally it's turned into something that I I really like listening to almost every single song and it's amazing um, Pandora Pandora is really awesome also, this map, really confusing. What the hell? And I can jump down almost anywhere? Okay, well that's crap. Um, this is this map's gonna get a little confusing. So I don't know if I can get back up. I mean, obviously I would assume I can, but for now let's stay up here before I jump down. I just wanna run, hide it away. This other band, this one that just came on, the Downtown Fiction. Ugh, so good. Sorry, I know I'm talking about a lot of music right now, but these are my interests. And I'm sorry if you don't particularly care for them. Oh, headband, headgear that gives off a sense of one's iron will for those few determined ones who walk their own path in life. Whoa, I can jump down way far. But I'm not sure where I get back up. Let's go all the way up 
first and then we'll jump down. But anyways, these videos are not also necessarily just about the game. I mean, they're primarily about the game, but they're also about life going on. Sometimes pop culture, sometimes current events. And in today's case, music. That's just how it, how it, how I roll, damn it. Um, okay, silver ore. So it looks like there's nowhere else to go. Up, at least. Oh, there we go. Okay. Ah. So there's, there's something back here. Okay, so that the that's the way we continue, but it looks like here is Fuck it. There's a chest down here anyways. Wow. Ooh. Okay, that was a big jump. There's sparkle points and chests down here that I want to get. So it looks like we climb up here. This place? It's, all messed up. it's a liminal region where multiple spirit climbs collide. It is indeed one of Rashagar's most messed up regions. <laughs> yeah, Tipo, this place is pretty confusing. Um, what is this? Oh, hi, thing. Okay. Um, yeah, there's actually a lot of stuff down here. Bags, sparkle points, there was a, the chest, peach berry blossom, is that what it said? Um, so I want to go into my equipment real quick, because there was something that I did find... The headband, the silver hat, that's what I found. So I found some armor. Not for me. Holy crap, that would boost my A defense. Significantly. Ooh, you can use it. And so could... I. Nope, that'll drop him down. Even though that'll bring up our A defense significantly, I think uh, you would do more with... Do better with it because it'll up both of yours, whereas it'll only up... One of Alvin's and Jude's. Um, so it looks like we have the headband now. Let's... I like the bushy eyebrows. I really do. But let's give him a headband. We're starting to get to a point where we can differentiate between our characters at least a little I bit. I fear that this new look has elevated my aura of refined masculinity to dangerous new <laughs> <sighs> And they say age and humility go hand in hand. Oh, Rowan's easily one of my new favorite characters. Him and Tipo are amazing. Up, oh, sorry, less less than Jake is another one. That's fantastic. Okay. Ah, oh, so that lowest point we had come to. That's how we got back up, or where specifically we got back up. Okay. Let's head on to the this way. I guess I don't need to really cut unless we can do a fight again. Up. Oh. All right, well, that's kind of cool. At least we can't get into a fight when we're hanging. I'm also keep, been keeping my eyes out for more Bakidas. Um, no more since the forest, sadly. Okay, which direction do we go? Um, we gotta go right here. Okay, sweet. I don't want to jump all the way back down again on accident. All right, Northwest region. Which is as equally as messed up as before, but this time we're going to start with the bottom, now that we know for a fact that we can get back up. Ooh, new enemy? Ah, yes, there's a bee in here. I was just going to go ahead and cut this out and then clear out the whole bottom of enemies, but, uh, actually, new one here. So I guess we should probably show this fight. Oh, Panic at the Disco. This one just came on, too. Um, I used to listen to them in high school, ironically. And there's not... They're not... A lot of the bands that I'm also listening off are not necessarily ska. Panic at the Disco and, and Fall Out Boy are not disco. They are definitely more pop-ish slash emo slash kind of music. But for me, I just want the songs to sound good. They've got good vocals. They've got a good sound to them. And it just kind of all meshes together. That's more what I'm looking for in music. And if it's catchy, which a lot of this is. So I don't really care if someone's going to go, <laughs> you, you listen to Panic at the Disco? <laughs> well, first of all, they randomly chose it for me. And yeah, I could probably skip it. Um, even though I've limited skips per hour, I, I could skip it if I really wanted to. But 
broaden your horizons a little bit and you'd be surprised. Like third wave ska. Alright. There's a bag. Aha! Uh -huh. I got past you. 750 gold. Okay. So there wasn't, there wasn't too much down here as at the last map. Ah, alright. Well, I'll take both of these out then. Okay. Killed the, all the monsters down here. Also, Elise leveled up, which is good. Come on, climb. Climb. There you go. I kept pressing X, and then so I would move to start climbing, and then I would just move off of it, and then, yeah. Really dumb. Okay. Um, big sprawling areas. Graces and uh, Zillia, this one, are very similar games in a lot of the way that its uh, world and story kind of unfolds. More the world, less the story, but still kind of similar. Okay, actually, no, I take that back. Grace's story is pretty wildly different in how it unfolds. Um, but the worlds, worlds are pretty... Um, they flow in a very, very similar fashion, which is interesting to look at. Uh, less world mappy, more big areas to explore, which is kind of cool. Ooh, Aquabats. Martian Girl is a really good song. Look up Martian Girl by the Aquabats. That's a good one. I don't know why I don't have that one thumbs up yet. Her hair. She climbed up there. Mila's reward. Saved by Rowan once again. Yeah, I don't even worry about enemy spirit arts anymore. No, I'm just honored that my old geezer tricks could be of use to you. You really are one handy geezer. I feel like we youngins ought to be bowing our heads in thanks. Uh, oh, we should. Thank you, damn. Elder. Oh my, no need for that. This is getting a little embarrassing. <laughs> Very well then. I'll simply pat you on the head. That's just pa patronizing. Good. Uh, that takes me oh, back whoops. to my youth. Such happy memories. I accidentally I'll skipped keep it. Doing my best. What? Ah, dude. It's actually working? Uh yeah, don't worry. Um Roman's a badass. And he's on our side. <laughs> Alright, anything else over here? Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, let's kick your ass. Okay. Chest time. Pure white puffballs. More of that. We got a lot of stuff to give to um, shops when we get back into a town with them. Or if we come across a roving trader. That'd be kind of cool. Ah, oh, more fights. Ooh, but you are here. Sweet. Elixirs. Nice. All right. I'm going to run straight through these mobs here. I'll be right back. We are going. Oh, and of course, Alvin started talking. Okay. Killed that second bee. Looks like there's a, a chest here. Ooh, fancy ribbon. All right, that'll go for the girls. Not for you. How about for Elise? Not for you either. Because I don't really feel like dropping one of your defenses. And supple ivy. That's creepy. It's called supple ivy. Uh, so it looks like we can go up. But isn't this where we technically came from but just from the other side it looks like it okay just double checking we all right and then on through here ooh lincoln park it's um pandora keeps giving me lincoln park too which i still like i don't know what people why people are complaining of lincoln park one they're a part of my childhood because they debuted when I was in middle school, so they're always going to hold a sort of soft spot for me. But their music, you know, in the last five to ten years has still been pretty damn decent. So I don't know what people want to complain, why people complain about certain things that they do. Um, just because other people like it or just because it's slightly different than what you want it to be, maybe? I don't know. It's... It's actually kind of dumb, but I mean, granted, like what you want to like. That's not the problem here. Or at least that's not the, what the the problem is. I kind of see it. Uh, skill seal during battle, 
the afflicted character's skills will not take effect. Even when the battle ends, the skill seal effect will remain. You must use an item or some other method to cure it. Okay. Um, if you don't like something, then don't like something. That's totally fine. But at least don't like it for the right reasons, if that makes any sense. Don't like it just because somebody else likes it. Don't like it because you just don't like it. That's a good enough reason. You don't like something because you don't like it is valid. It's a very valid reason to not like something. You just don't. Maybe you don't know how to explain it, or maybe you can't explain it, but don't let the reasoning be because somebody else likes it, or because it's slightly different than what you expected or what you wanted. You're not the artist, and that's, I mean, that's, I think that's something that's very valid that I can speak to creating content online. Um, I'm not going to create content like somebody else. I'm not going to try to pretend to be a PewDiePie. Or however the fuck you say it. I'm not going to try to pretend to be an AVGN, even though the RNG I recorded was a little AVGN-ish. But that's just because the game really sucked. So, I, and I like AVGNs, so I was able to kind of channel my AVGN a little bit. But I'm not going to go and make every video a copy of what he does, right? I'm not going to go and copy Nintendo Capri Sun, even though I really love Nintendo Capri Sun. And a little bit of how he acts kind of bleeds over a little bit because... I've watched so much of his stuff, so sometimes I can see that, oh, you're acting like him, but, you know, I'm not going to make every video like other people. I'm going to make it like me. I have influences, and I have likes, and I have dislikes, but I can push a boulder. Um, but I'm not going to parody or create every, make, uh, not parody in the sense of make fun of, but parody as in be exactly like all the time like other people i'm me so i create my content how i want to create it and if somebody else comes along and goes well that's not how i wanted you to create it well i'm sorry that that's not how you wanted it to be but if you happen to like it then watch it if it happened to be something different than you expected watch it anyways with a little bit of an open mind and, and maybe you might still like it same difference with music even if it's a little bit different the core is active now but what can we do up here? Uh. Grow wings. Good thinking. I shall cast a channeling circle on the erupting spirit energy. We may be able to ride it down safely, but only if we can maintain control. So are we gonna dive in? <laughs> Should've kept my mouth shut. We're only gonna get one chance to hit the core. <sighs> Let's do it. What are we waiting for? We have to save those citizens. Right. There's no other way. Yep. <laughs> Your metal is inspiring. <laughs> Thanks. Young lady, will you wait here, please? Nope. She's with us through and through. All right, then. Hold on tight, okay? This might be a turbulent flight. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, did he just make a paper airplane? That's pretty badass. <laughs> he totally made a paper airplane. Also, the suicide suicide machines also fantastic. That's a little bit more punky than Skull, though. I think. Come on, you can do it. Uh. Damn. Apparently, we can take on the world. It's good to know. All right, guys, we're here to get you out. We're not going to let this government There's do Klein. research on you. Uh, Crap. Are you all right? Forgive me. I dashed off again without heeding your warnings, and I shouldn't have. You were just trying to do what we thought was right. Safe. Do you know if Noctigol is still here? I came here to demand answers about all of this, but his personal guard took me captive. <laughs> I see. Oh, I just hate, hate, hate this place. Let's get out. This Spud's right. <laughs> I'm getting bad vibes here. Boss time. Watch out. Get back. Oh. 
What the fuck is that thing? Oh dear lord. Oh no. What's that? We're about to find out. Alright, fight time. Let's do it. Okay. Um it's hard to hear them. Okay, um, so you're weak against, is that Earth? What, why am I putting my arms up? That's not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to go right, but fine, whatever. Oh, ow, ow, stop. Okay. At least we resist some of his attacks. That's good. Uh, sharing is caring. How much health does this thing have? Okay, not too, too much, but it is a boss. It just did it just ring a bell on my head? Oh, okay. This thing is kicking our ass, and it's not even particularly hard hitting or fast. It's just holy crap. Okay, I get it. I'm trying to go. Let's go right, not up. I'm trying to sidestep. That's not working apparently. Come on, stop ringing bells on my friend's heads. Yeah, there we go. Igneous Crush. Now I want to get the left meter up, because then we can just constantly combo this damn thing. Alright. Good, at least keep me healed. Ah, here we go. There we go. Let's do it. Come on. Oh, he's up too high. Damn. We wasted the charge on the, on the left. He's almost dead, though. He was just up too high for my, any of my attacks to connect, so I couldn't do any of my comboing with Rowan. Damn. The song's a little weird to be listening to while make, doing a boss fight, of all things. Come on, come on. He's almost, almost there. Damn, stop, stop, stop. Bad. Having, um... Well, I guess Rowan was a little, a little ranged, but having Alvin on this fight probably would have been better. Only because he's got ranged attacks. Damn. Come on. You know what? I hate... I don't like this boss. He's up too high. Here, come on. Come on. Attack! Why are you not attacking? Come on. There we go. Nope, 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 nope. Bad. I don't like this fucking boss. Oh, I'm out of a TP. That's why I'm not doing any of my arts. Duh. Should have seen that. Um, let's do this. Um, no, I don't have a 60% TP. All right, that's fine. Come on. Ow, 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 ow. That bell hurts. And I just wasted my TP. Damn it. Um. Shit, 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 shit. She. Come on. Come, come on. This thing only has 519 health left. Wow. Why was that last... 1800 uh, HP is so difficult to deal with. That was that was bullshit. We got him though, but it was bullshit. Uh, winged boots, ooh, and earth cape. Sweet. And then everyone but Elise leveled up. Even Alvin leveled up. Nice. Hold up! What do you think you're doing? Wait. Beautiful beast. Can't you feel it? What? They're lesser spirits. Oh. They're oh, what? How wonderful. Wowie Kazowie. Wowie Kazowie. Thank you, Jude. Huh? I forgot myself and nearly destroyed those lesser spirits. Oh. Um. Uh. 
Then, shall we return to Sherrilton? These people had intolerable amounts of mana extracted from them. Nutschgall will pay for this. A show of spirits. Those lesser spirits were so beautiful. I've never seen one before until now. I've encountered some during my time, but not the numbers we just witnessed. Then you're just like us. Indeed I am. Rowan, thank you for taking my hand when we jumped. You needn't thank me at all. I merely did what I'd do for any of my friends. That's right. <laughs> We're friends. Yay! I never thought we'd make friends with someone much older. <laughs> You're very good with children. No, not at all. I just know how to treat a lady. And such a charmer as well. I do get that a lot. <laughs> you do. All right, I like him. Oh, damn, another one? A home for Elise. I'm sorry we put you in danger again. It's okay. You don't need to say that. We're friends now. Are you sure? Even I get freaked out traveling with Mila sometimes. You and me both. Hey, Elise, I bet we can find some place nice and quiet for you to live around here. You'd be away from all this danger. But I don't want to leave. This is out of the blue. You got a line on someone who'd be willing to take her? Well, not yet. Don't go making promises you can't keep! <laughs> so what's the plan, kid? I'll figure something out. I promised Mila I would. For Mila, huh? Alright. Um, let's see if there's anything in these cages. Because I have a feeling there might be. I just have a feeling that there might be some... Uh, sparkles or some secrets around that would be good to take while I'm here and also knowing my luck there actually won't be anything but I thought I'd at least look to, to double check yeah it looks like mm, there's nothing here god damn I thought I'd be so smart and look and then I'm, oh look at that sweet I found something Oh, hey, look, there is something. Melange gels. Okay, close. Good enough, I guess. Oh, there's chests everywhere. I was looking in the cages, but I missed... Oh, no, there's just the two. <laughs> okay. Well, at least I found two chests. That's better than nothing. All right. Um, and then where was that save point? Was it right out here? Aha, it is. Alright guys, so that is going to be it for this episode of Let's Play Tales of Zelia. If you liked this episode, please consider subscribing, thumbsing it up, and sending it to your friends. I would greatly appreciate it. Remember, I do this sort of thing tw all week long. I do a show called RNG called... Uh, a show called RNG twice a week. So if you like the sound of my voice, or if you like the way I commentate, or you like... Video games? <laughs> consider subscribing for me. That would great... I would greatly appreciate it, and it would benefit me greatly. Remember, Freaks and Geeks play more games, and I'll see you folks next time. Have a good day. Yeah.